What's uh, first update? My legs hurt like shit, which is amazing because that means I worked out decently yesterday. Um, second update, I actually yesterday forgot to talk about something super cool. So yesterday I shared the video that I found um, from Charity Water, that, um, that um, nonprofit that I found, the video that I, that I put into the vlog yesterday, you remember? Um, so actually the backstory on that is that so I was listening last week, I think, to a podcast with Reed Hoffman, the Masters of Scale podcast. By the way, amazing podcast, probably my favorite podcast, um, with this dude called Scott Harrison. And he's the CEO and founder of Charity Water, um, which is a nonprofit that um, builds wells. And um, basically their mission is to have, to give every human being on the planet have access to clean water and um, in their podcast they kind of talk about one video that they that they put out at some point which is called no I want to spend 10 minutes by the way amazing plugin do you want to stay on YouTube yes 10 minutes um, the spring charity water story um, you should watch it by the way it's an amazing amazing video but I watched that yesterday and then I was so inspired and I love that story I love the charity I love the background of Scott Harrison the founder of it that I decided to donate $20 every month to charity water but I actually also decided that so after that I checked out the um, let me actually show you guys the LinkedIn because that's what I usually do with people. Like if I meet someone, I check out their LinkedIn. Um, so Scott Harrison is actually a super accomplished entrepreneur in general. He, um, he has an episode with Gary Vee, um, was on a couple of podcasts before he um, founded Charity Water, which is one of the most innovative charities out there currently. Um, he was a club promoter in New York City, city for 10 years and apparently was super successful and, um, and known for that. And so his LinkedIn, Scott Harrison, Harrison, checked it out and it was pretty unexciting. I mean, he doesn't even have a head of photo, um, he has 21,000 followers, which are all just because he's kind of like uh, mainstream in the uh, the um, well in the entrepreneurial like community. But he really never posts something. His last post was a month ago. Before that, it was three months ago. So basically, he does nothing with this LinkedIn. But on the things he posts, he gets a really good engagement, right? 907 likes, 63 comments on a picture with his book, and. Um, so I decided to send him an email and say like, hey, I checked out your, your LinkedIn and I would love to help you out with your LinkedIn and grow it for free because like, I wanna help you out. Actually, yeah, like look at this. Charity Water is a legit thing, 500, 250 employees at this time. And so this is the email I sent him. So there's, you can always find someone's email. There's a plugin called Clearbit and um, it basically allows you to find anyone's email. So I found this email um, and I sent him an email saying, I actually also sent him an Instagram DM and he also saw my Instagram DM. He actually liked my Instagram DM. Um, but I sent him this email. Hey Scott, um, where are we? Your podcast with Reed Hoffman was one of my favorite episodes ever. It was also the first time I learned about your charity water from that I went on to watch the spring video on YouTube and just decided to donate $20 every month. I probably got wet eyes three times during the video, which is true. I'm sending you this, this email because I also checked out your LinkedIn, saw that you're almost not doing anything with it. I started a company called Project 33 five months ago and we helped startup founders build their personal brand on LinkedIn. Long story short, I wanna grow your LinkedIn for free. There's so much potential and we could just repurpose a lot of the content that is already out there from you, interviews, keynotes, key keynotes your books, etc., and reach a bigger audience on YouTube. I truly believe this could at least to some part help bring even more awareness to Charity Water and would evolve very little to none of your time. Wow, I'm also fucking tired. Mm. I believe in your guys' mission and want to help out as best as I can with my current skill set. 
because I truly believe I can do more, have more impact with that than with any amount of money that I can donate right now and with my budget. And um, he replied. Woo! He said, Finn, thanks for reaching out, looping in CC to have a conversation and explore. She's handling my LinkedIn and calendar. I literally do nothing with it, but would love to have a better presence and page. Appreciate it. And I replied to hopefully hop on a call with CC. And um, yeah, that's super exciting. Like, um, I don't even know why I did it. I never did something like that, but I think it's because it rarely happens that you stumble upon a person where it's just so clear from, from spending very little amount of time that they're a decent human being. Like, right, I don't know him. Like, I only watch pretty much, I only listen to one podcast and watch one video. But, uh, oh shit, I'm gonna take a nap after this. Um, but it's very rare to have someone that you, f you genuinely feel like is a decent human being after such short time. And especially someone who is then also fucking executing on that being a decent human being. I mean, he built one of the most successful and innovative charities, nonprofits out there right now. So he's fucking legit. And so, yeah, I want to give back. I want to do something good. Um, and so I'm excited to do that. That's super cool. And I, I wanted to update you guys on that. Um, I'm going to keep you guys updated on that, what will come out of that. Um, and what we're going to do with this LinkedIn. And if I'm going to cop on a call with his assistant and all of that stuff, but oh, I'm sorry for that. Yeah, then I'm super tired, but yeah. Super cool, super stoked about that, and let's see what happens with that. Good night, I'm gonna take a nap now. Hard to wake up when there's no alarm to wake you up. Sitting, breathing, doing all the things I hate a lot, but why not? Holy shit, I just wanna make it. China